here we are again. Not only were we rocked by the White House fence jumper last September, but now we are confronted by yet another unfortunate incident that appears to entail significant misconduct. On March 4th, two possibly intoxicated secret agents drove a government car through an active, suspicious package investigation. I say possibly because according to news reports, no sobriety tests were administered. The agents were not arrested, and they were allowed to leave the scene. This latest episode seems to be more evidence of a cultural issue that has not been adequately addressed by changes in senior management. It's going to take time to change maybe some of this culture. Uh, there's no excuse for this information not to come up the chain. I'm frustrated. I'm uh, very <laughs> frustrated that we didn't know about this. I didn't know about this till Monday. Uh, let me just say this. The president, the first family, they're safe. Uh, we've moved these individuals to non-supervisory positions rather than administrative um, leave where they're getting paid for no work. Your actions, in my judgment, should be punishment, termination, firing people who have uh, subordinated their command. Uh, you can't run an agency like this, for God's sakes, or any other agency.